Now, you know how much time you have. You know what your general health is. You know what your physical ability is. You're all ready to plan and work for improvement. You've been training for decades, or maybe never at all, but want to build a powerful physique and superhero strength. There's a spectrum of health and fitness with every single thing you can imagine in between. And what the industry has been doing and serving people for the last several decades has riddled the population with falsehoods, untruths, and deceit. These ideas of losing weight or building muscle just for appearance sake or pseudo strength have borne consequences both measurable and detrimental in ramification. Four out of five people carry 25% or higher excess body fat, which means excess weight fatiguing their joints as well as their minds. And four out of five people in the human race succumb to back pain, whether they're overweight or skinny or exercising or even athletes. Eventually, giving up and settling, even though so much more is possible. And the cure? The sustainable implementation of these eight basic strength moves that require nothing more than the ground from which we were created or the tree stemming from the same place. And two bonus moves at the end. The front lever. Upon attaining this specific strength move, my pain from five bulging discs spinal stenosis and arthritis disappeared. Imagine the core strength, the longissimus thoracis and transversus abdominis in maximal engagement and every single muscle of the legs and arms lifting and stabilizing the entire skeletal structure. Next, take that same front lever and implement a row with the arms. The front lever row builds full body pulling strength with the rhomboid, scapula and latissimus dorsi. Now take the body and suspend it vertically. And then release one hand and then pull the entirety of one's mass upward into the third move, the one-arm pull-up. Quite straightforward to train when you have a system just like our students are showing. And then from that one arm, the fourth move, lifting with the entirety of the arm and then twisting with the obliques to accomplish the meat hook. But core strength is not only built from the hanging position, but also laterally with the human flag. This move is specifically responsible for the strength of the longissimus thoracis and overall spinal health. As a matter of fact, it really doesn't matter how good a person's six pack looks. If they can't do a front lever or human flag, their core is actually just as weak as the rest of the population. Now, into the sixth move, the back lever. This should be built with great caution and care as it places an extreme stress on the distal end of the bicep tendon, for but small tendons hold everything together. Yet the back lever is the gateway to even more difficult feats of strength, such as the Maltese and other straight arm strength work. Nothing shows mastery of simple body weight pushing strength than the handstand push-up, our seventh move, building trapezius, deltoids, and triceps of steel. And it is maintaining just this move that will keep you healthy for life. And still further, it allows for a range of other training modalities such as straight arm press training, power moves, and makes you solid from the inside out. More advanced than the vertical handstand push-up is the eighth move, planche push-up. Through all of the necessary progressions, the triceps are built like none other. And then for bonus move number one, you can take your planche or handstand and place them above the rings or in straps along with your other straight arm work. When we speak of handstands on demand at all angles or building an iron core of powerful strength, this is one such situation demanding great strength and control from the entire body. Strength begets balance, not the other way around. And then, bonus move number two, our 10th move, which brings us back to hanging moves, but not just the utilization of the pulling muscles, but also the pushing where the triceps and deltoids are engaged in hanging strength shifted to one arm for our final move, the one arm back flag. Now it must be emphasized, even if these seem impossible right now, through progressive individualized training, they are not only possible, but can become basics. And like many of our students say, and I'm doing things that I never would have trained. Training should be conducted with great care and caution and especially coaching so that the ideal, 
the strength of what we were designed and intended to be can come forth like a statue emerging from the raw marble. It is time to reclaim the curious adventure of strength, skill, and transformation. Crush the subscribe button, share this with a friend, and click any of the links below to begin your transformation. And I'll see you in the next video.